Well, hello, boys and girls. It's when I feel like it o'clock. I'm Pearl of Wisdom, and you're listening to my NHL Pearls of Wisdom. Now, in the good stations, they stop here and then do something and show you uh, back, whatever, but I'm not one of them. <laughs> Anyways, um, I'm in the bathroom, and this time I'm going to tell you why I'm in the bathroom, because I just got some news this morning um, that... Uh, I want to give one. I want to give a player some encouragement out there. Um, I'm in the bathroom because up until eight months ago, I was an addict, and uh, I uh, I decided to change. And in doing so, I had to downgrade my life. And I'm living with a bunch of people that it's hard to find privacy here. This is really I could the only place I have in the house that gives me the privacy to do these fine videos for you, this fine programming. Um, but it came to uh, uh, Bobby Ryan has entered the uh, player assistance program. Bobby Ryan plays for the Ottawa Senators now. Um, he, <laughs> I could feel like he was struggling his whole career. He was second, a second overall pick, if I remember correctly. Um, I can't remember who was picked around him, but uh, they were very good players that were picked around him. Um, had his troubles in Anaheim, went to Ottawa, and his career just seemed to go down and down and down. And everybody was wondering, what's wrong with Bobby Ryan? Now, there was some uh, rumors out there that he was a partier and all that, and being an addict myself, I watched, when I watched him and I watched the way he reacted to things and interviews and stuff like that, I really thought that he had a problem. I, I thought he had a problem. Um, and it turns out he does. He does. Uh, it's not necessarily to do, the assistance program is not necessarily to do with drugs and alcohol, but really it kind of is. And um, I just want to say, buddy, freaking that took a lot of courage, man. And uh, you know what? I know you're watching right now because who's not watching? Uh, <laughs> I know you're watching right now. And, you know, you had a fa you've had an amazing career considering the struggles that you've been going through. I imagine this has been extremely difficult on your life. And uh, I, I know you're going to go and you're going to learn a whole lot about yourself and you're going to come back and have a even longer career and you're going to overcome this you're going to be amazing you are amazing right now you're a fantastic human being um, amazingly skilled and i'm sure you have so many other talents that you're not even aware of i want you to know you are amazing dude and you are going to overcome this uh in this program i bet you're going to learn so much about why you were and all the shame is going to be gone and all that bullshit. And you're going to come back and just freaking be on fire like me right now. <laughs> I wish I would be nice if I could go back to a million dollar hockey position. But you know what? This feels like a million dollar hockey position because I love doing this thing, these for you. Our picks yesterday, uh, we did 10 for 13. That was fantastic. And I can thank a lot of the guys that comment on the bottom here because they're always helping me with information on who's injured, who's not, all of those things like that. This is not like I'm thinking to myself this morning, you know, how much is this me? It's not. It's us. We're doing this. We, we're going to create a fantastic channel here. We're going to go see Bobby Ryan play in the... Ottawa or whatever, maybe on the road, and we're gonna give, we're gonna have Bobby Ryan signs. We're gonna be like, we love you, dude. We love you, because we do. And uh, I know, I just want you to know that, Bobby. You, you, we love you, man, and we are so rooting for. We're not rooting for you. We know you're going to get through all this. You're going to become. Uh, you're going to become even greater greatness than you already are. And this channel, like this channel, is going to become the greatest greatness of all time, of all channels. Um, and the other, the other guy, not better than the other guys, they're gonna be great too, like Ricketts Picks. He's, uh, he's a fantastic human being. And there's a lot, oh, um, Frankie Arbuckle, that's another one. I love this guy, go check him out. Frankie Arbuckle, he doesn't have many subscribers and stuff right now, but I love his delivery, I think he's amazing. Uh, I watch him all the time. Uh, he's like, he's one of my faves. Okay, so. 
Now we're going to get to our picks today after that long ramble. <laughs> uh, the Sens versus the Habs. Um, this is the Sens after this news of Bobby Ryan going into this. Uh, they're kind of a tired team, but I have, I cannot not pick them now. I can't pick them. They're going to rally for their dude and they are going to play amazing. This is a kind of thing that can bring a team that has maybe limited talent or think people on paper looks like a limited talent and they can just start winning and winning and winning. You know what? I bet you Mr. DJ Smith had something to do with this. He was able to talk Bobby Ryan into making the right choice by not shaming him or anything. Anyways, I'll bet you he does. I love you, DJ. I love you, man. I, I'm rooting for the Ottawa Senators for the rest of the season, just so they can ride on the back. Uh, so Bobby doesn't feel bad about himself that he's leaving the team. Uh, I can just hear him now, man. They're going to crush this game tonight. Crush it. I am saying that the Sens win by a lot because uh, um, the Habs are without Rowan. They've got Kincaid in net. Um, they're not feeling all that great about themselves right now. I'm going to take the Sens and I'm going to say 5-2 over. Bet this one just for Bobby, man. Bet it for Bobby. That's what I'm saying. Uh, Caps and the Rangers. Uh, the Caps have played a lot of games. This could be an upset. It really could. They have played a lot. Not sure who's going to be in net. I have a feeling it might be Samsonov. Um, but with the Rangers, it's Lundqvist, and we don't know what we're getting with Lundqvist. I'm still taking the Caps. Because they're tired, I think there, there could be some defensive breakdowns that happen. And uh, the Rangers will probably pot a couple. The Rangers got quite a bit of talent in there. Uh, although Capo Capo is uh, Caco Capo. Capo Capo? <laughs> that would be an unfortunate name. Caco Capo, who was the first, second overall pick last year, isn't going to be in the lineup. And I just, I, I just, even though the Caps are tired, they just seem to always be able to pull it through. And they can play any way you want, defensively, offensively. I have a feeling they're going to um, rely on their offense and it's going to be about 4-3. So that's my full 42%, boys and girls. I'd like to tell you that uh, today's the 20th. Three days ago was my eighth month clean. I'm so excited. I'm so excited for life and I'm so excited for how awesome this is going to be. Hit the subscribe button. Let's make this incredible. Let's get together sometime and frolic and all of that. I'm frolicking now, so I might as well frolic with you, right? Have a great day and lots of love to you, especially today. Today is Bobby Day, man. Bobby is amazing. Bobby Ryan.